Mumbai Local Railway Update, Multi-Tracking from Kurla to CST, Kolyan to Kasara and Kolyan to Asangan. Mumbai, the bustling metropolis that never sleeps, relies heavily on its intricate network of local and long-distance trains to keep its millions of residents moving. However, the city's rail infrastructure has long been plagued by challenges such as overcrowding, delays, and congestion, particularly during peak hours. In response to these pressing issues, and in a bid to revolutionize Mumbai's rail network, the Central Railway has recently unveiled an ambitious plan to enhance Mumbai's rail network through the implementation of a new fifth and sixth line connecting Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj Terminus, CSMT, to Kurla. Earlier, last year in September 2023 and November 2023, news media had reported the update of the new third-line project between Kolyan and Kasara and the new fourth-line project between Kolyan and Asangan. These ambitious projects aims to tackle the challenges posed by the overcrowded local trains and the seamless movement of mail and express trains. They seek to address the current shortcomings of the rail system while preparing it for the future needs of the rapidly growing city. The information details for this video has been gathered from various news reports of March 15, 2024, November 12, 2023, November 10, 2023 and September 23, 2023. Hi friend! Welcome back to SciTech Buzz One channel. We wish to sincerely thank all the new subscribers of this channel. We have observed that 97% of our viewers haven't subscribed to our channel. If you haven't as yet subscribed, kindly consider doing so, after watching this video, since it would encourage us to do more. Watch this interesting video until the end so that you will not miss out on all the details. Let's delve deeper into the intricacies of these transformative Central Railways Mumbai Local Rail Network projects. Objectives of these projects at the heart of the Central Railway's proposal lies the objective of segregating the movement of local and long-distance trains. By creating dedicated tracks for each type of service, the project's aims to optimize efficiency, improve punctuality, and enhance the overall passenger experience. Additionally, the projects seek to alleviate congestion on existing tracks and provide much-needed relief to commuters who rely on Mumbai's rail network for their daily commute. This will ensure smoother operations and enhanced efficiency. Scopes of these projects The scopes of these projects are vast and encompass the construction of a new fifth and sixth line between CSMT and Kurla, the construction of a new third line between Kolyan and Kasara and a new fourth line between Kolyan and Asangan. The new fifth and sixth line between CSMT and Kurla will be executed in two distinct phases, with careful planning and coordination required to minimize disruption to existing services. The expansion plan builds upon the existing infrastructure, leveraging the operational fifth and sixth lines between Kolyan and LTT, and extending them to cover the crucial stretch between Kurla and CSMT. Current Existing Infrastructure before delving into the details of the expansion project, it's essential to understand the existing infrastructure of Mumbai's rail network. The city's rail system comprises a complex network of tracks, stations, and signaling systems, all of which work together to facilitate the movement of trains throughout the day. The fifth and sixth lines, which are already operational between Kolyan and LTT, serve as the foundation for the proposed expansion. By leveraging this existing infrastructure, the Central Railway aims to minimize costs and expedite the implementation process. The expansion plan seeks to extend these lines from Kurla all the way up to CSMT. For the other two projects, the new third line between Kolyan and Kasara and a new fourth line between Kolyan and Asangan, it will be an addition of new tracks to the existing rail network between Kolyan and Kasara. Benefits of these three projects the benefits of these three multi-tracking or expansion projects are manifold and promise to usher in a new era of efficiency and reliability for Mumbai's rail network. 1. Enhanced local train services. By segregating tracks for local and long-distance trains, the project will significantly increase the capacity for local train services. This will translate into more frequent trains and reduced wait times for passengers, particularly during peak hours. 2. Improved crowd management. 
One of the most pressing challenges facing Mumbai's rail network is overcrowding, especially during rush hours. The expansion project aims to alleviate congestion by providing dedicated tracks for local trains, thus allowing for smoother passenger flow and reduced platform overcrowding. 3. Prevention of speed reduction. Currently, the sharing of tracks between local and long-distance trains often leads to speed reductions and delays. By separating these two types of services, the project will enable faster and more reliable journeys for passengers, thereby enhancing overall efficiency. 4. Enhanced punctuality. Both local and long-distance trains stand to benefit from the improved scheduling and operational efficiency afforded by the 5th and 6th line expansion. By streamlining operations and reducing conflicts between different types of trains, the project will help ensure that trains adhere to their timetables more consistently. Project Update for Kurla, CST New 5th and 6th Line Project Cost of Project While the benefits of the 5th and 6th Line Expansion Project are undeniable, it's essential to consider the associated costs. The estimated cost for the project stands at 920 rupees crore, based on 2016 figures. This includes expenses related to land acquisition, construction, signaling systems, and other necessary infrastructure upgrades. While this may seem like a significant investment, the long-term benefits of the project far outweigh the initial costs, making it a worthwhile endeavor for the Central Railway and the City of Mumbai as a whole. Status Update of Project As with any large-scale infrastructure project, the 5th and 6th Line Expansion Project has encountered its fair share of challenges and setbacks. However, progress is being made, and significant milestones have already been achieved. 1. Land Acquisition The process of acquiring the land required for the expansion project is currently underway. This involves negotiating with landowners, acquiring necessary permits and approvals, and ensuring that all legal and regulatory requirements are met. 2. Demolition of Shown Bridge One of the key components of the expansion project involves the demolition of the Shown Bridge to make way for the new tracks. This process is scheduled to take place following the conclusion of the 10th and 12th board exams, ensuring minimal disruption to students and commuters. 3. Elevated track construction. To accommodate the new tracks, elevated track construction is underway at Kurla for the Harbour Link. This involves the construction of elevated platforms, bridges, and other infrastructure necessary to support the expanded rail network. Fourth, platform construction. Construction of new platforms on the west side has already commenced, marking significant progress in the implementation of the expansion project. These platforms will serve as crucial hubs for passenger boarding and alighting, providing essential connectivity to local communities. 5. Track Conversion Once the elevated track construction is complete, the ground-level track of the harbor line will be converted into the 5th and 6th lines, further expanding the capacity of Mumbai's rail network. Official Statement by Pearl According to Swapnil Nila, Chief Public Relations Officer of Central Railway, the suburban corridor in Mumbai is one of the busiest rail networks in the country. The implementation of the 5th and 6th line expansion project is poised to alleviate congestion and bolster the capacity to run both suburban and long-distance trains in a timely manner. With a headway of 3 to 4 minutes between two trains and the operation of long-distance trains, this initiative holds paramount importance in enhancing Mumbai's rail infrastructure. Progress Update of Kalyankasara New Third Line Project This ambitious endeavor, aimed at enhancing mobility and alleviating congestion along the Kalyankasara Suburban and Mail Express route, as per news reports of 10 th November 2023 and 12th November 2023, has achieved a commendable milestone, boasting an impressive 50% overall physical progress along its expansive 67.35 km length. Investment and Expenditure With a total investment of 792.89 crore Indian rupees, this project stands as a testament to Central Railway's commitment to modernizing and expanding its infrastructure. Notably, an expenditure of 641.33 crore Indian rupees has been allocated towards various components of the project, underlining the significant financial commitment and resources dedicated to its fruition. 
Land Acquisition and Infrastructure Development Critical to the project's advancement is the acquisition of land, a process that has seen substantial progress, with 73.04% of the required 49.23 hectares already secured. This underscores the meticulous planning and execution strategies employed to ensure the smooth progression of the initiative. Project Milestones Delving into the intricate details of the project's development, several key milestones have been achieved. Earthwork progress, a substantial 38% of the earthwork, totaling 9.11 lkm out of 24.04 lkm, has been completed, laying the groundwork for further construction activities. Structural development, progress is evident in various structural elements, with 5 out of 8 major bridges, 23 out of 203 minor bridges slash rubs, and 2 road over bridges, are obese, currently in progress. Station building and OHE foundations, infrastructure development extends to station buildings, with 9% completion noted, alongside 15% progress in overhead equipment, OHE, foundations, and 14% OHE mass directions. Enhanced connectivity and mobility. Upon its completion, the new third line between Kolyan and Kasara is poised to revolutionize rail connectivity in the region. By mitigating congestion on vital suburban and express routes, the project will not only enhance the efficiency of passenger commutes but also streamline freight transport operations, thus bolstering overall train mobility and reliability. Central Railway's Commitment to Expansion The progress achieved in the Mumbai Division is emblematic of Central Railway's broader commitment to infrastructure expansion and modernization. Across its five divisions, notable strides have been made in doubling, third, and fourth new lines, with a cumulative completion of 161.80 km of multi-tracking in the current fiscal year. This ambitious endeavor, supported by a planned budget of 3,890 crore Indian rupees, underscores the railway's unwavering dedication to meeting the evolving needs of commuters and facilitating seamless transportation networks. Progress Update of Kalyanasangan New Fourth Line Project Kalyanasangan Fourth Line In addition to the Kalyankasara expansion, as per news reports of 23 RD September 2023, work is underway on the Kalyanasangan Fourth Line Project. This ambitious endeavor, estimated at 1,759 rupees crores, involves acquiring substantial private land. A Sangin, serving as a vital suburban terminal between Kolyan and Kasara, witnesses a high volume of suburban train activities. Status Update of this Project The Kolyanasangan Fourth Line Project is in the process of land acquisition, laying the groundwork for future construction activities. This project, with its significant investment and strategic importance, is poised to further enhance the efficiency of suburban and long-distance train services in the region. Conclusion In conclusion, these multi-tracking or expansion projects represent a significant milestone in the evolution of Mumbai's rail network. By segregating tracks for local and long-distance trains, the project promises to enhance efficiency, improve punctuality, and alleviate congestion for millions of commuters. While challenges remain, progress is being made, and the project is well on its way to transforming Mumbai's rail infrastructure for the better. As the city continues to grow and evolve, investments in projects like these are essential to ensuring that Mumbai remains a vibrant and connected metropolis for generations to come. Stay tuned for further developments on these projects. Do let us know your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos. Thank you.